Everyone loves legendaries. Okay, maybe not everyone, but you do. That's why you clicked on this video anyways, right? Right? Okay, let's be honest here. We all just want to be rich in Adopt Me and having legendaries is one way to get there. But aren't they like so hard to get and take a lot of time to hatch? Well, no, because in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get legendaries super fast and super easily. These tips and tricks have helped me so much and I'm super excited to share them with you. So let's get right into the video. By the end of this video, if you already knew three or more tips I've mentioned, then make sure to comment this emoji. Tip number one, trade neons for legendaries. I'd say this is a really easy and helpful tip since you could get a legendary even with a common or uncommon neon pet. And common and uncommon neons don't take that long to make. It also helps if the neon is preppy or basically cute because sometimes you could get overpays just because the pet is cute. Tip number two, trade ultra rares for legendaries. You could get a legendary for probably five ultra rares, but sometimes you might have to add if your ultra rare pets aren't that good, but it definitely works. Tip number three, do the common to legendary challenge. In this, you're gonna have to trade your common for a uncommon pet, trade that uncommon pet for a rare, and trade that rare pet for a ultra rare pet. And finally, trade it for a legendary. You might not always get a legendary through this challenge, but you definitely end up with something better than you had. Tip 4. Ask people. Often when you trade, especially in a rich server, people won't be able to notice you because all of the megas and neons kind of block you from other people, if that makes sense. So spamming in the chat doesn't always work. So sometimes you're gonna have to ask random people using the trading chat to offer for your pet instead. This isn't completely related to the topic, but it helps me a lot, even though some people might find this annoying. I just, I just don't really care. Tip 5. Hatch eggs in public servers. Fun fact, I've never actually hatched a legendary in a private server. The legendaries I've hatched um, throughout the years of playing Adopt Me they're all in public servers, so I do suggest hatching eggs in public servers. I've also heard somewhere that hatching eggs in multiple accounts at the same time works too, but I'm not 100% sure. Tip 6. TikTok hacks. Okay, most of those hacks you see on TikTok and YouTube may be fake. Okay, they are fake, but I like to just try them out for fun, uh, you know, while I hatch eggs. Because sometimes they actually work, and I have nothing to lose except for obviously my time. Tip number 7. Trade cute or preppy petware. I've gotten legendaries from preppy petware before, so I can tell you it works. But it really depends on what kind of petware it is and how cute or aesthetic it looks. Tip number 8. Build for legendaries. Okay, so I wasn't sure if I wanted to mention this tip because it's not 100% guaranteed that you get the pet after you build because you might get scammed. But I like building sky castles for legendaries even though sometimes I do get scammed as I said. So now I just build for my friends, but yeah, it does work sometimes. Tip number 9. Trade eggs for legendaries. You could get a legendary for 9 eggs or lesser depending on what egg it is. 
It also helps if the egg just launched into the game because people are likely to overpay when an item is new or is just super old. Tip number 10, which is the final tip of this video, and it is to be patient. You won't be able to get a legendary or get tons of legendaries right away. It does take time. Just don't lose hope because people keep declining. Maybe add some more items or change the item if you keep getting declined by people. You'll definitely find someone if you keep trying. Um, so yeah, basically just don't lose hope. And congrats, you just reached the end of this video. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like and subscribe. Make sure to comment this emoji if you knew more than 3 tips by the end of this video. If you have any extra tips at all, feel free to comment them down in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Bye and have a great day or night.